tithes are the nisim b'chol yom, the blessings for the daily miracles of our lives. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam Asher natam l'sek pi v'nalachim v'en yom v'en la'am Amen Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam Pokei achivim Amen Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam Matir asurim Amen Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam Zokef kefufim Amen Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam Rokaha aretz al hamayim. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam. Hamechin metzadeh gaver. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam. Malbish arumi. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam. Hanotem ayaef koa. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam. Hamavir shenayim yinaitu mamayaf apar. Amen. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu Amen. If you look on the facing page, you'll find an amazing piece that was written in French in 1927 by a French composer named Edmund Flegg. And in the mid, in the years between the two wars, people were asking themselves very hard questions. Why remain Jewish? Why can't we just be part of the universe of humanity? And he writes the following, and I'm going to read it, and I invite you to read it with me. I am a Jew because the faith of Israel demands no abdication of my mind. I am a Jew because the faith of Israel requires all the devotion of my heart. I am a Jew because in every place where suffering weeps, the Jew weeps. I am a Jew because at every time the Jew hopes. I am a Jew because the word of Israel is the oldest and the newest. I am a Jew because Israel's promise is the universal promise. I am a Jew because Israel, the world is not completed, we are completing it. I am a Jew because for Israel, humanity is not created, we are creating it. I am a Jew because Israel places humanity and its unity above the nations and above Israel itself. I am a Jew because above humanity, image of the divine unity. Continue on the next page, 86 or 204. Jenny leads us in the blessing for daily Torah study. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech ha'olam asher kitshanu v'mitzotav v'tzivanu la'asok v'divrei Torah. Amen. Facing page at the top, in English, we read together. We seekers of God, how do we find you? In good deeds and in the study of Torah. And your search for us, you find us in the bending of the knee, in the rigorous study, and the honesty of commerce, through a good heart, through decency, in respect, respect through true fellowship, fellowship, companionship, and love, through truth and peace, in the no that is really no, and the yes that is really yes. Baruch Adonai Hamlamed Torah Le'amo Yisrael. On the following page on the right, you'll find the listing of the daily limitless commandments. We do the first line to the second line, and then skip down to where it says Eluhein. Elu de varim shein la hem shi o, 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 Hashkamat Ben Hamidrat Shahari Be'arvi Elu Devarim She'en Lahem Shikor Elu Devarim She'en Lahem Shikor Elu Devarim She'en Lahem Shikor Ve'elu En Ve'ahnasat Orchim Ubikor Cholim Ve'ahnasat Kala Ulva Ulva Yadame Ve'eyun tila, ve'eyun 
Adam We read it in translation below because it's wonderful to study Torah in the original. Always is, but it's also nice to know what in the world you're saying. So, these are things that are limitless, in which a person enjoys the fruit of the world, while the principle remains in the world to come. They are honoring one's father and mother, engaging in deeds of compassion, arriving early for study, morning and evening, dealing graciously with guests, visiting the sick, providing for the wedding couple, accompanying the dead for burial, being devoted in prayer. But this so if you turn the page, it's 209 in the brackets, 91 if you're not in the brackets. It's traditional when you study Torah or Talmud that there is a version of the Kaddish called the Kaddishta Rabbanan. And the English version was written many years ago by David Friedman, which is a favorite in Armenian. And on the top of 209 or 91, it goes like this. For our teachers and their students and the students of the students, we ask for peace and love and kindness, and let us say Amen. And for those who study Torah here and everywhere, may they be blessed with all they need, and let us say Amen. We ask for question for you all. We're not going to go around the room because that's going to take too long. So what's one thing that you remember or you will remember from middle school? Talk to your neighbors. <laughs> so if you don't know your neighbor, introduce yourself. We always ask a question between Miracle to Shachar and Suge to Zimra and we get to know each other because we pay, pray better with people we know. What's one thing wonderful, tragic, horrible, embarrassing, whatever, it is from middle school. Jenny, what a great question. <laughs> oh, we only have one rule here. This is not therapy. If you have therapy, <laughs> we'll have, you'll have to fill out a form if it's therapy. Can you turn the mic on? Would you like to join us? What's the thing that you remember from middle school? Well, I was in, in, I was in uh, the band, I believe, Me alto too. sax.
We didn't have junior middle high. school. It was junior high. Junior high. I know, no, I know what we called yeah. it, but we it, we <laughs> didn't. I am. How's everybody doing? Blue, blue and gray. I'm hoping that you actually were able to say something light <laughs> and not the trauma of being rejected from your volleyball team or whatever it was, or not being able to function in gym by not being able to climb the rope. Who had to climb the rope in gym, by the way? Anybody beside me have the to climb ladder. the rope in gym? We had yeah. to hang on the oh. ladder. <laughs> yeah. Do you get to? We're going to continue with Jenny, Seeking. Do you want to share yours? Maybe Jenny I, wants I, to I share. I want to share yours? Okay. Like So we're on page 94, it's 212 <laughs> in the brackets. Baruch She'amar as we begin our section of Psalms. Baruch She'amar ve'hayalam. Join me. Baruch Hu, Baruch Hosev Reshit, Baruch Omer Ve'oseh, Baruch Hosev Umkayim, Baruch Merachem top of the next page we read the brief passage in English as we set an intention, a covenant, to praise God through Psalms. Hareni mizamen et pi lehodot lelel l'shabeach et bori. With this do I prepare myself to thank, praise, and glorify my Creator. Blessed are you, Sovereign of Life. And we pray. Maruch atavanai melech mehulal batishpachot. On the following page you'll find Ms. Moshili Yom HaShabbat. We're going to be reading in English to the indent. When you see the indent, you'll go up to the upper Hebrew where there is an indent for Tzadik Katamar, which will sing in an old, I hopefully familiar tone or tune. A psalm, a song for Shabbat. Sing hymns to your name, O Most High, to proclaim your steadfast love at daybreak, your faithfulness each night. The ten stringed harp with vo voice and lyre together. You have gladdened me by your deeds, Adonai. I shout for joy your handiwork. How great are your works, Adonai. How very subtle your designs. A brute cannot know. A fool cannot understand this. The righteous... Tzadik Atamar Hifrach, Hifrach, Tzadik Atamar Hifrach. Ready to get your hands ready. You got to clap there, right? Tzadik Atamar Hifrach, Hifrach, Tzadik Atamar Hifrach. Tzadik Atamar Hifrach, Hifrach, Tzadik Atamar Hifrach. Ke'eres balvanon yizke, ke'eres balvanon yizke, ke'eres balvanon yizke. One more time, 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 one more time,
hard times. Sadika to my Ifra, Ifra, Sadika to my Ifra, Sadika to my Ifra, Ifra, Sadika to my Ifra. Keres Babylonis, Keres Babylonis, Keres Babylonis, Keres Babylonis, Keres Babylonis, Keres Babylonis. Look at that last verse. We will all praise you, O God. From now to eternity. If you don't know this melody or the tune, the last word of the chorus is hallelujah, which I think everybody knows. It goes like this. about this minion that Jenny loves is it really is not a spectator minion. There's really no place for people just coming and watching. And she doesn't want people to watch her. She wants people to be led by her and to be taken to a higher spiritual plane. Right, Jenny? Yes. yes. <laughs> so we're going to do Hallelujah four times this chorus. We're going to start out softly. We're going to build. By the end, maybe just close your eyes and let it all go. The Hallelujah. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. A little more now, hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Even more now. Oh uh -huh. 
everything. Shabbat's all about breathing. Turn the page. Psalm 150. Two. Second line. on the following page. It's page 102. Or 220. Even if our mouths were full, full of songs, songs of the sea, sea, and our tongues full of joy and countless waves, and our lips full of praise as wide as the sky's expanse, and, and were our eyes to shine like sun and moon, if our hands were spread out like heaven's eagles, and our feet swift like young deer, we could never thank you adequately out of nine. A God and God of our ancestors, to bless your name for a ten thousandth of the many myriads of times you granted favors to our ancestors and to us. So turn the page and look in the lower left. The Chatima that ends this section is found there. Five lines in Hebrew it goes like this. Baruch Ata Adonai.
As you are able, please rise for the Chatzit Kaddish before the bar. Turn the page. Amen. Amen. Please turn to page 108 for Bar. Whatever you plan to do next, go ahead. Turn the page. We're in the middle of the left-hand side. Go ahead. Read. Love your neighbor as yourself, you said, and light blinded we saw that inner and outer worlds are one, as you are one. You spoke and we wrote. We reached down for you down the centuries. Your light moving before us as we climbed, fell back and climbed again. Your Sinai of life. Ruach Adonai, habocher be'amo Yisrael be'ahava. Turn the page for Shema. Shema Yisrael, Adonai Eloheinu, Adonai. Page 234 for Ver Hafta. Please be seated. Ver Hafta et Adonai lo hecha, Verchol evavcha, Verchol nafshecha, Verchol meodecha, Verhayu hadvarim ha'ele, Asher anochim metzavcha, היום על לבבך, ושינת העם למענך, ודיברת בם. ושבתך ביתך, וברקתך בדרך, ושוכבך ובקומך, וקשרתם להיות על ידך, והיו לטוטפות בין עיניך, וכתבתם. Amazes of Betacha, Uvi Sharecha, 
Lema anti skeru vasi ten a comisro tie. The eat him below she, Melwehem. Ahani Adonahaerwehem. I share a tate ye can bear a tinkrahim. He old lachem, Lelohim. Ahani Adonahaerwehem. Top of page 236. Vayom <laughs> Thus you shall remember to observe all my commandments and to be holy to your God. I am Adonai your God, who brought you out of the land of Egypt to be your God. I am Adonai your God. Adonai Elohim. Emmet, there is no place where you are not. Even in the wilderness there is your word. Emmet, the pen strokes of lightning, white fire, black flame, stir the soul's passion, guide our sacred way. Now, and certain and established, now and your forever voice should and be more, the dominant one. like Moses, Miriam, and all of Israel, we sing out and rejoice. Come Page 242. Elohe Abraham, Elohe Yitzchak, Elohe Yaakov, Elohe Sarah, Elohe Rivka, Elohe Rachel, Elohe Leah, Ha'el Hagadol, Hagibor, Mahanara, El Elyon, Go Melchasevim Tovim, Bekane Hachol, Bezoker Kastea, Bovimelot, Omevigolalivnevenehem, <laughs> Mechachel Kaim Bechesed, Mechaye Hachol Verachanim Rabbi, So Mech Nofim Verachel Kohomim, Umatir Rasurim, Umekaye Memunato, Vishene Yafaha, 
To all generations we will declare your greatness and for all eternity proclaim your holiness. Your praise, O God, shall never depart from our lips. Blessed are you, Adonai, the holy God. Please be seated. Page 250. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Shamre, 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 Shabbat Vekore, Honek Shabbat, Yismechu Vemalakutecha, Shamre, 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 Shabbat Vekore, Honek Shabbat, Amenam Mekade, Mekade Sheshevi Shabbat, Kulam Yisu. Reached <laughs> Red seed above the key dash to Shahabad, Kemdat Yamim, Oto is got a Shahabad, Yismehu, Vemalakutaka, Shome, 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 Shahabad, the Kore, One Shahabad, Yismehu, Vemalakutaka. Shame, 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 Shabbat, Bekore, Onek Shabbat. Zeche, Vemase, Vemase, Vereshi, Shabbat. Zeche, Vemase, Vemase, Vereshi, Shabbat. Yismechu, Vemalachu, Techa. Shomre, 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 Shabbat, Vekore, Honek Shabbat. Yismechu, Vemalachu, Techa. 
Shomrei, Shomrei, Shomrei Shabbat V'korei Olei Shabbat Top of page 253. We offer thanks, O God, for this Shabbat, which unites us in faith and hope. For Shabbat holiness, which inspires sacred living. For Shabbat memories, glowing even in darkness. For Shabbat peace, born of friendship and love. We offer thanks and blessing, O God. Baruch Mekadesh HaShabbat. So, in our tradition, for well more than 150 years, Reform Judaism has not had a silent Amidah. And yet, we realize that something is lost when you don't have an opportunity to pray these prayers in your own way. So after the Kedushat Hayom, the sanctification of the day, in our minion upstairs, we always leave about four minutes for people to pray either the last parts of the Amidah on their own or to go back and pray the Amidah the way they're used to. Many of our people stand, many of our people sit, some people have a talus over their heads. It is complete, wonderful chaos, and you can do what you want for the next four minutes, which is not exactly a long time. So please enjoy the next four minutes in your own private prayer, and then we'll come back together for Sim Shalom. Sim Shalom Tova Ubracha Chain Vachesed Racha Mima Meinu Veralko Israel Amecha Veroinu Yotainu Kolano Mecha Veor Panecha Sim 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 Shalom Sim Shalom Tova Ubracha Sim Sim, sim shalom, tova uvracha. Kibo lecha nata nata man, nata manu. Adonai ta'im shalom, 
services here anytime. Thanks. <laughs> we're about to get ready for the Torah service where we're going to read from Parsha Truma, which is the portion of the week all over the Jewish world. There are kumashim that people will be able to follow in, and we're going to get ready for that right now. If you look in your books on page, somebody call it out, 362 in the brackets, right? And we're going to ask you to rise as you're able for the opening of the ark. Stand right here, okay? So he's going to hand the torch over. Okay? Put your book down. Follow me. Follow me. Ain't come a chava Elohim Adonai Ve'ain't come a sepa Malchutecha malchut kol olamim Omemshotecha bechodor vador I don't know I melech, I don't know I malach, I don't know I'm loch le alam boed, I don't know I oz le amoyitein, I don't know I varech et amo vashalom, acharachamim, eti baver tzonecha etziyon, This is our Torah. This is our heritage. By this heritage, our ancestors lived. For the sake of it, they often had to die. But always this treasure and heritage was passed on to a new generation of young and eager hands to have and hold, to learn, to make their very own. Today, when we celebrate a wonderful young woman like Jenny, who's taller than me, and we're so happy, yeah, just about. You'll be there in a month. Anyway, we're so happy to thought of this Torah, which she represents so beautifully in prayer and in spirit, being handed on to her in another generational passing on of love and Torah. So we'll take the Torah from which she will read today, and we'll pass it yet once again from generation to generation from her mother to her. We continue with Kimitsio. Ki mitzion te Torah, ki Ki hol ba 
seated we're doing two aliyot from truma and you can find it in the larger blue books not the prayer books but the larger blue books that are in front of you on page 608 so what it is is exodus chapter 26 starting with verse for verse 15 about making the planks because you need the wood for the torah port for the uh, the tabernacle and all the things that are going to be in it what we have it For the first Aliyah. Tamod Hanabat Moshe Balea, Ha Aliyah Arishona. Baruch Adonai Hamvarach Leolam Baruch Adonai Hamvarach Leolam Ba'ed Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Asher Bachar Banu Mikol HaAmin Benatan Lanu Et Torato Baruch Ata Adonai Noten HaTorah Amen Amen Vesita Et Hasera Shirim Lamitan Asher Shishim Omdim Asher Amot Orech Akeresh Ramahatsi <laughs> Baruch Ata Adonai Eloheinu Melech HaOlam Asher Natan Lanu Torah Demet Vechai Olam Natan Betochenu Baruch Ata Adonai Noten HaTorah Amen. Are you ready? We get to call Jenny by the special call we have for our bat mitzvah students, our bar mitzvah students. The first time they're called in their official capacity as an adult. That's fine. I know she's already done this at her school, but we get to do it on Shabbat with a lot of joy. So we get to say, Tamod, 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 Libarekata Kriya, Rachel Bat Hanna, Bat Mitzvah. Baruch and I am Baruch and I am Baruch and Asher Bachar Bani Mikol Amim Venatam Anu Atorto Baruch Atah Adonai Noten Hatorah Amen Vasi 
Shita Kashim, Mamishkan, Esrim, Kesh the Fat, Giva Da, Tamina, Nigbat, Taman, the Arbaim, Adne Kasev, Tase, Tahat, Esrim, Hakeresh, Shini Yeranim, Tahat, a Keresh, Haehad. Lishte yidu tav, le ushne adanim, takate keresh hai had. Lishte ultil tav, ultilte la hamishkan, hashinit, le thaat safron esrim, karesh le arbaim, ad nehem, kesev sheni, ad ne adanim. Takata Keresh I had, Shnea Ranim, Takata Karish I had. Hamishkan Uyakate Hamishkan Yama Tase Shisha Kerashim Ushne Kerashim Tase Uli Nuxot Hamishkan Berechatahim Vayihu Tamihim Mamata Varechada Vayihu Tamihu Vayihu Tamim Al Rishoho Rishoho Al El Had Tabaota Hatabaat Haecha Haechad Kena the Nile Vishyeh Vishnehem Vishne Hamiktod Yihu Vihu Shmonat Kerashim the Arne Arnehem Kesef Shisha Sar Adnehem Adanim Shne Adanim Tahad the Keresh Haechad Ushne Adanim Tahad Hakeresh Haechad Bas Sita Brikim at say she team Hamisha, the Karshet, Sela Hamishkan, Hai Had, the Hamisha Brikim, the Karshet, Sela Hamishkan, Hashinit, the Hamisha Brikim, the Karshet, Sela Hamishkan, Layakatayim Yama, the Habriya Hatihon, the Toh Hakashim, Mavriah Min Hakatel Hakatse, the Ed Hakarashim Hatibita Zah. Titape is a hub. The etabotehem toss is a hub. But in the briach, the tipita at her briach, Zahab. The had kemotaim at her at her mishkan. The kimishbato, I share her rate of a Ashina Tamara Tarata, Nefa Hailam, the Tabu Tokenu, for a Katar and I know ten Hatara. Amen. 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 Okay. We're going to cover this. While the Torah is open, it's as if our hearts are uniquely open for many kinds of prayers and blessings. And so we're going to do three prayers right now. The first prayer is the prayer for the well-being of Israel. And they, where are Beth and Michael J Micah Jacobs? Are they here? Come on up. Shalayim, Yishlayim, Avayla, 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 
Avinu Shabbat Shalayim, Sur Yisrael Vagolo, Maret et Medina Yisrael, Reshit, Simchat Gulatinu, Hagain Alecha, Vebra Chazdecha, Ufras Alecha, Sukat Shlomecha, Ushlach Zorcha, Bamidcha, Varashecha, Zaracha, Vio Adzecha, but Vatak name Vitza Tova Milfanacha, Vatata Shalom Baaret, Vasimcha Olam Leoshe Veha, Venomar Amen. Let's do just this part again. O Heavenly One, Protector and Redeemer of Israel, bless the state of Israel, which marks the dawning of hope for all who seek peace. Shield it beneath the wings of your love, spread over the canopy of your peace. Send your light and truth to all who lead and advise, guiding them with your good counsel. Establish peace in the land and fullness of joy for all who dwell there. Amen. If you're following in your prayer book, the, the uh, prayer for our country is on page 258. You get to read this wonderful blistering passage from Isaiah right here. Okay? How, how much do I read? Oh, my goodness. Okay. Thus says Adonai, this is what I desire, to unlock the fetters of wicked, witness, uh, wickedness and untie the cords of lawlessness, to let the oppressed go free to break every, off every rope, yoke, sorry. Share your bread with the hungry and take the wretched poor into your home. When you see the naked, give clothing and do not ignore your own kin. Oh, if you banish the yoke from your midst, the menacing hand, the evil speech, if you offer compassion to the hungry and satisfy the famished creature, then your light shall shine in the darkness. Thank you. The third prayer we do, while the Torah is open, can we move the bear up? Healing. It's on 253 in the non-bracketed um, pages. It's our custom to ask you to share the names of those for whom you wish healing on this Shabbat. Many of us know people who are in the hospital right now or facing a difficult time or are lonely or challenged in their world. And so as I look at your part of the congregation, please feel free to say a name out loud of somebody for whom you wish healing. And the only thing, especially for our students, is please don't raise your hand. Class is out for the week. And just call them out so that we can add the names of the people that you are concerned about into our hearts and into our prayers for Misha Vera. Shmuel ben Mara. Through the
Myra, why don't you come on up? We're going to call you by Hebrew name. Please, everybody, rise as you are able as the Torah is lifted up high. Well, Ira and Linda, where's Linda? Please come. There you go. Find your seat, everybody. Rachel, we need your services. Is there anybody else who's willing to hand out candy today? I have three no, baskets. Anybody else wanting to hand for out sure, candy? Sure. Thank you. you. Come on up now. Like, like now, oh. here's the deal. For those of you who are visiting us for the first time, it is not intermission. So please, we're not giving you snacks. What we're doing is we're getting ready to toss sweetness gently in the general direction of Jenny after she finishes her Haftarah and her Haftarah blessing. Her Haftarah blessing is in the prayer book. The Haftarah for Truma can be found in your book, the larger blue book. It's First Kings, chapter 6, verse 1. Vayhi bishmonim, is that it? Yes. Mm -hmm. It's at the bottom of page 717 in the larger blue book. And again, like the Torah, this will not be translated, so we, we really hope that you'll follow along as she does her Haftarah. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu mehelech alaham Asher bachar binvihim tovihim V'ratah v'dibrehem hanemarim behemet Baruch atah Adonai Habacher b'atorah uvmoshe avdoho Uv Yisrael amoho Uvinviyeh hanmet v'atzedek Vayehi hi bishmonim shana verba meot shana latzet bene Israel me eret mi trahim. Vashana ha revit vachoresh siv. Hu ha chodesh hashenihi lim lok shlomo al Israel. Vayiven ha vayit ladonai. Vahala hayit heserbanaha. Hamelech Shlomo, Ladon Ahai, Shishi Amah, Orko, Vesrim Rohoch Bo, Ushlashim Amah Komatoho, Vahulam, Alpene Hecha, Habait, Esrim Amah Orko, Alpene Rochba Habait, Eserba Amah Rochba, Alpene Habait, Vayas Labait, Kalane shekufi matu mihim, vayi van al kir habayid yatsia savihiv, et kirot habayid savihiv, la hechal velarvir vayas la ot savihiv, la hatsia hatechona kame eshbama rochba hatechona sheshbama rochba. 
והשלישי שבע במה רוחבה כי מגדרות נתן לבית סביב חוצה לבלתי אוזני וקירות הבית ברוך אתה אדוני אלוהינו מלך העולם צור כל העולמים צדיק בכל הדורות היה הנאמן האומר ועושה המדבר ומקיים שכל דבריו אמת וצדק על התורה ועל העבודה ועל הנביאים ועל יום השבת הזה שנתת לנו אדוני אלוהינו לקדושה ומנוחה וכבוד ולתפארת על הכל אדוני אלוהינו אנחנו מודים לך ומברכים אותם מפרק שמך לפי חוכי תמיד בלב ואה ברוך אתה אדוני מקדש השבת page 256 is 374 in the brackets. We're going to ask you to rise as you're able as the Torah comes forward to the front of the pulpit. Yeah, hallelujah, shem Adonai, ki nizkaf shem olevado, odo haleretz v'shamayim, v'yarem kerem ne'amo, de'ilan echo, For a good heritage have I given you, do not forsake it. It's our strongly held belief here that bar and bat mitzvah students 
show that they are ready to enter into the adult Jewish world by demonstrating not just facility and competence, but excellence in three areas. Okay. One is leading services, and Jenny led more of the service than many of our students do, partly because of her community day training and partly because of her commitment to the Shabbat morning minion, where all of our melodies become kind of the fabric of our souls. The second is to be able to read Torah. She read beautifully in Torah and in Haftarah. But the third is just as important, to be able to share with us her thoughts about what the portion means. And Truma is a challenging portion. It's not just about the general rules of being nice to each other or following God's commandments. There are very specific instructions. We're just waiting to hear your Torah. Please. Okay. Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. When I was a small child, I would go everywhere with my mom, to events, to parties, to meet with clients, everywhere. Sometimes my mom will see someone in the store and be all like, hi, it's so nice to see you. How have you been? And then they'll turn to me and say, look at how big you are. I remember when you were just a tiny thing. Embarrassing as it was, it got me a taste of the community that surrounds me and my family and how it impacts us. My parasha is in Truma, in Exodus, after the Israelites have escaped and received the Ten Commandments from Sinai. In it are the, ten, are the instructions on how to be the Mishkan, or tabernacle, the ark, what it must be made of, who can go where, and where the altar should go to give sacrifices. There are four different layers on the ark, the courtyard, the tent, the incense altar, and then the room where the ark was kept and where God would come down to the Israelite people. The courtyard was open to the priests and to the whole community on the high holidays where they asked forgiveness from God and offered sacrifices. The room in the tent would be open to, to regular priests twice a day to light a stick of incense at the golden altar. Moses could go into the room with the ark any time God called him, but Aaron, the high priest and Moses' brother, was only allowed in there on Yom Kippur, the holiest day of the Jewish year. My community is also much like the ark. It has layers, family and family friends, regular friends, acquaintances, and then just people who I only know their face. I am part of Karate, Repair the World, The Free Store, Grow Pittsburgh, and the Girl Scouts. Just like the ark to the Israelites, my communities are sacred to me. These layers had to be built, and new people are always added once I get to know somebody, or I see someone with a familiar face from long ago, so they never stop growing and expanding. We each have our own communities surrounding us, both personal and communal. Whether they're throughout the world or just inside a small town, they are our own and are all precious to us. My Tikkun Olam project is donating to the Braddock Free Store, which I learned of through Repair the World. Multiple people depend on the Free Store for food, clothes, and other necessities. People of all ages, races, and socioeconomic status come to the store whenever they need help with essentials and more, and they can only get that, thanks to help, get that help thanks to donations from people and stores alike. This is important to the community because it helps people get through difficult times that they might not have the strength to get through by themselves, but they can get there thanks to the support of complete strangers. If we can get to a place where everybody can help out someone in need, that can have a really positive effect on the world. Each of us can do this by giving it to charity or helping a homeless person or even just giving someone a smile, any small thing. Thank you to everybody who has joined me here from California and for the spirits of those not with us. Thank you to Kanner Berman, who has, helped me, who has helped me through the entirety of the preparation for, for this day and also for putting up with me. Thank you to Rabbi Gorbin and her support for making me laugh and helping me through this whole process. And last but not least, my mother, who stuck by me even when I was being incredibly stubborn and rude and who made this whole thing come together and for making this day a special one that I will always remember. Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. Come on. You face me. Oh, it's not on. I get to be the first one to say mazel, mazel, mazel tov. Face me. Okay. There you go. <laughs> I love what you said. One of the things we tried to say to talk about last night was where is God in the community? And God is in the community in our finest acts, our intentions, and our eyes. And when we align our faces, remember when I talked about that? Right. Next week, not this week, is called Shabbat Zahor. It's when we remember the bad things that happened to us on the way out of Egypt. And we remember it just before Purim, because Purim is a disaster waiting to happen, and then all of a sudden things turn out wonderful because of the heroism of Esther, her ability to stand up for herself, for her family, and our people. 
There's this passage about this enemy people. It's called Amalek. And the special Torah reading for next week is Deuteronomy 25, 17 to 19. And we're told that we have to remember Amalek. Why? Not just because they attacked us, but they cut down the stragglers in our rear, the old and the weak. They didn't attack the strongest in a fair fight. They cut down the people who were vulnerable. And for that, we're supposed to always look out for those who want to cut down the vulnerable. But one sage asks, not about Amalek and their evil actions, but about what you're saying in our community. Why were there stragglers? Why didn't we surround them with protection and love? Why didn't we take care of them? Why were there stragglers to cut down, to attack at all? And I think that you, not only through your words of Torah and your words of prayer, but your words of teaching, have told us that we can't afford to have stragglers. Why? Because who knows the day when we will go from being well off to being a straggler? Who knows the day when we ourselves will need protection? And so I'm going to continue the theme of Truma, building the physical structure, to next week, just before Purim, where the community structure that's going to inhabit that space is just as important. Yes, it's vital to know where the boards go, and you read that beautifully in your Torah. But it's just as important to know where people go, where people belong, where people can share, not just in the good times as accessing God, but in the bad times when God seems lost to us. Every single person in this room has had a time in his or her life when they wondered where God is. And one time, a student of a Hasidic master said, I can't find God in my prayer book, in my Torah, in my study, even my walks in nature. Where is God? And the master looked at his student and said, God is wherever we let God in. It's my hope and prayer for you that even when you face challenges, obstacles, and difficulties, that you remember your resolve to help your community as you shared with us today, and that you let God in because you are a precious, precious gift of God. You, Jenny, are irreplaceable. You are a blessing. And I hope and pray with all of my heart that you are blessed throughout your entire life, even as Cantor Berman is about to bless you at this moment with Rabbi Gorman and me. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. And we invite all of you to be part of this blessing. CDF's favorite melody. <laughs> Yevarecha Adonai Vishmerecha Yaer Adonai Panavelecha Vichunecha Isa Adonai Panavelecha Vyasem Lecha Shalom Everyone! Shalom, Shalom Yasem lecha shalom, shalom. Ma yasem lecha shalom, shalom, shalom. Yasem lecha shalom, shalom. Ma yasem lecha shalom. May God bless you and keep you. May the light of God shine on you and may God be gracious to you. And may God lift up God's presence to you so that you may let God in to your mind and heart and to your world, so you may find wholeness, joy, and peace as together we all say. Amen. Can you join us in a Shekhyanu? Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech olam Shekhyanu Imanu ve'higyanu lazman I'm so proud of you today, and you have done such an amazing job. And we are so grateful for our community to all be here. So um, I'm just going to say a few words. Um, I'm going to share a story from when you were a small child, where we went to the Westmoreland County Fair, 
and when Jenny was very small, I'm like two or three, uh, with, and, and we, there were the, one of those big, you know, slides that's like eight stories tall. And uh, Auntie Denise said, don't worry, I'll hold on to her. And up all the stairs. But even as a small child, she just had this presence, like she knew what she was doing. And so, you know, the guy just gave her her own burlap sack and off she went. And she sat down and, and I'm watching with horror this tiny little child bouncing down this huge eight-story slide. And as parents, you know, you never let on when you're afraid. So, in, and I just, you know, eventually slid to a stop upside down and backwards. <laughs> and I put a big smile on my face. And I thought, and, 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 the, and you got up and you were a little dizzy. And I said, how was it? How fun is that? And you immediately were like, I want to do it again. <laughs> so this, this fearlessness and, and, um, and, and a willing to, to, to kind of take risks and, and to learn new things and, and, and to be independent is a tremendous gift and a tremendous responsibility that you have as you come into adulthood to learn how to channel that in good ways. We have generations of, of, of our ancestors who have been immigrants, who have fled from war and fled from persecution. And they have moved from state to state to find opportunities. My father went, hitchhiked all the way across the country during wartime to go help his older brother. And so, even though not so many of our family have passed and we honor their memory today. And I hope that you will continue to embody that sense of fun and responsibility and commitment to family and honoring the Torah. And you did such a beautiful job today. I'm so proud of you and I love you. Where's Chaim? He's got this down. Come on over here so you can hold the mic. Do I see a clean, more clean shaven? I, I, I almost missed you. I, I haven't shaved since last Purim, so it's okay. like a <laughs> surprising everybody. Um, so first of all, on behalf of Community Day, congratulations. Mazel Tov, Yashir Koak, you did an amazing job. Um, at Community Day, we are always trying to make, one of, one of our guiding principles is to create students who are mensches. It's not just about like what grades you get, it is about being somebody who is part of the community, being somebody who is aware of those around them. And in many ways, Jenny goes beyond what any of us could have imagined, whether it is befriending the people who sometimes we, the rest of us don't notice. Sometimes that we, you know, the, the custodial staff or uh, the, the, the genders or the, the people in the, in the cafeteria serving food. And it's not just like, hi or thank you or please, it's she knows their names and she talks to them and she, she takes time out of her life to find the people in the community so that she can constantly grow her community. And so it is an incredible thing to see if there is a stranger coming to school who wants to tour, Jenny is the first one to volunteer to meet them and to guide them and to talk to them. And it is all that we as a school can hope for in our students. So on behalf of us, thank you for being that person. And again, congratulations in Yashir Koach. Thank you. Representing our board, Elizabeth Kalura has presents because we want, to ha we want you to have to write thank you notes. Right? No. You're going to write thank you notes, right? Okay. 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 Just, just got it back on. Jenny, one of the most uh, fun and um, moving things you get to do as a member of the Board of Trustees is to come and present gifts to the Bar and Bat Mitzvah students. And it's always a pleasure to see how hard they have worked and what they have been able to do for the congregation. 
in your case, it's especially inspiring. I, I just think it's amazing the way that you have made this service your own and how you are part of the Minion family and how you really brought everyone into your community and took ownership of this service. You've done an amazing job. I'm really proud of you. Um, we have presents here, and I'm going to spoil the surprise and let you know what they are. Um, we have a book called I Am Jewish. It's a collection of essays in memory of journalist Daniel Pearl about, uh, by different Jewish people about what it means to them to be Jewish and um, be a member of the Jewish community. Also a Kiddush cup, which we hope that you use in joy and in good health. And we just are so proud to have you be part of our community and look forward to all of the different That's roles that you take um, as we continue to move forward. Thanks, Jenny. Where are, where are those? Yeah, just, yeah, just, okay. And we, we want to offer certificates to you as well, not just of accomplishment of today, but looking toward the future as well. And we'll get them to you if we don't have them in our folder right now. But the most important things are the second half of the certificate, the right-hand side, is about not just today, but it's about tomorrow. It's about who you are going to be as a Jewish young woman. And so I always have students read that part, if you don't mind. And I'm going to look at this here, that you were bat mitzvah today, but you've accepted the lifelong responsibilities of being a Jewish or what? Can you see it? Lifelong Torah study and the keeping of mitzvot, Shabbat, holy day, and life cycle observances, participation in the life of the synagogue, the Jewish community, and Israel, dedication to tikkun olam, the perfection of our world. And you've signed in a decent penmanship, which I haven't seen in a long time. I just want you to know a lot of young people are not signing their, 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 their name because they keyboard everything. You also have certificates of scholarship. If you go with the reform movement at the end of your 10th grade year, this is $250 toward an Israel trip, and this is $2,200 $2, from the Jewish Federation of Greater Pittsburgh. We really want you to go. Okay. And if finances are an issue, please come to us, and we'll try to find the money to put it together so that you can go home to part of your land, part of your heritage. So I want you to take the certificates, I want you to take your books and everything, and I want you to sit down by your mom for the rest of the service. So who's here from out of town? I know San Diego's in the house. Anybody else from out of town? Anybody had to cross a river? Anybody had to cross a river? To, oh, you crossed a river to get here. Thank you so much for being part of our Shabbat morning service. This minion service really is led every Shabbat in the chapel with nobody standing up and leading. The melodies become part of the fabric of our spirituality, and we are so proud that Jenny wanted her bat mitzvah to reflect that and not the other bar and bat mitzvah experiences that we offer to students as well. So we're so proud of her. Uh, we're headed toward the end of our service. If you will find your prayer book once again and turn to page 586, you'll find Elenu, and I'll ask you to rise as you are able. As we prepare for Mornas Kaddish, we'll ask anyone to rise in place if they are observing the yard site of somebody in their family or in the present period of mourning as I am for my own mother. And because we believe that no one, no mourner should ever stand alone, we stand with our mourners and turn to page 598 as the mourners say their Kaddish. Amen. <laughs> 
Eat para, we eat to bop, we eat pa ar, we eat to mom, we eat not say. We eat to dar, we eat to lev, we eat to lal, shmeid kudsha, brichu. The elan min kol birchata vashirata, tush bichata vanechamata, da miram biyama vimru, amen. Yehe shlam araba min shemaya, the chaim aleinu v'yal kol Yisrael vimru, amen. Ose shalom bimramav, huya ase shalom. Aleinu ve'al kol Yisrael v'koish v'tevel v'yimru. Amen. May the source of peace in the high heavens cause peace to descend on all of us, all Israel, upon a broken world in need of our healing hands, upon all of us who mourn our beloved dead. As together we say, Amen. Amen. I'm going to invite Jenny to come back with all of her friends from Community Day for our final song. Ein Kelohenu is on 626. If you're visiting from another congregation, we like to say it's the one you know, so that you hope, hopefully all will join in. It'll be followed by a brief Kiddush and Motzi, and we'll be able to enjoy our festive Seudat Mitzvah, our meal of the mitzvah together. Yes. I understand. It'll be on. Okay. One. And we have to say that I hope um, it is not a general own egg. It is an RSVP luncheon for the family by the family. So I hope that does not prevent you, if you are not staying for lunch, to take the time to greet Jenny and congratulate her for a wonderful morning Shabbat of her bat mitzvah. Okay. Guys, Simon says three steps forward. One. Two. Three. You want to pick a key for us? Ready? In kelo heinu, in kadon heinu, in kemal keinu, in kemoshi heinu, mi kelo heinu, mi kadon heinu, mi kemal keinu, mi kemoshi heinu. No de lelo heinu, no de la donenu, no de le malkeinu, no de le moshienu. Baruch elo heinu, baruch adonenu, baruch malkeinu, baruch moshienu. Atahu elo heinu, atahu adonenu, atahu malkeinu, atahu moshienu. May be blessed every place you come into God's world. May be blessed every place you find your blessings and take them out into God's world as well. And together we say, Amen. 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 Therefore, God bless the seventh day and declared it holy. Let's have a Borei Priya Gafen here. Just the one. There you go. You going to lead us in Motsi? Baruch Atarona Eloheinu Melech Olam Hamotzi Lechem Shabbat Shalom Shabbat Shalom everyone Take Tara Tara There you go Okay it's over Shabbat Shalom Nice to have you